All right, guys, so if you guys can see, we're burnt pretty bad. I don't usually burn, this sucks, so we're modifying our workout to do things where we're not lying down with extra weight, putting pressure on our back here to make us feel like we're gonna die. So we're starting with the pec fly, and we're gonna show you guys some cool variations we do, and we adapt to circumstances. You don't always have to be on a linear, very direct program. You make changes when you need to, according to your situation. On a side note, Josh hit 315. Nice and easy, but the sunburn is absolutely no killing us, so let's go. If your waist begins with a two, eat. I see dead people. I need dead people. Lord, pretty flack of nailing kiss the ring. All hail the king. Long live ASAP. Put that on everything. One more, maybe. Fitness. A life fitness machine right now. Are my eyes deceiving you? tell them, Aaron. You know what? Why are you? We just told the fans, my back is friggin' dead. Why are you just doing your hammer strength over there? Loaded plates, go. You don't know what's in this gym. No, loaded plates. Oh, she's training, okay, let's go. go. All right, let's go, all right. Go. All right, so we're told by coach here that we have to use hammer strength because that's what cool kids do. So many people are coming up to me and being like, yo, you're burnt, bro. <laughs> so, <laughs> this sucks, but we're pushing through it. You get the first round done and we'll be looking pretty. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Buddy, how you feel? Panda, panda, panda. There you go, bud. So this one is going to be very non-obstructive to my back, thank goodness. I've done about as much as I can, so we're going to do this. Flies, uh, then some more triceps and it. So for chest hips, you're gonna want to lean forward. Really focus on squeezing that chest and pushing inward as you're pushing. Sounds funny, but if you do this, right away you're gonna engage your chest. See, it's the same as doing that. You'll tighten it up and force to engage it. That hurt a ton. <laughs> What's up, Mr. Krabs? Mr. Krabs? Oh. Wait, Mr. Krabs, my bad. Oh, Mr. Krabs. SpongeBob, dude. No, I know. They call me Kobe with this reach. What you know about Ron, boys? Uh, we're pretty tired, but today's really fun. Having a good workout so far, and I don't know. We decided we kind of switch it up, let you guys hang out with us more. A lot of videos have been motivational or very strict, but today's kind of just us scooping around. Yeah? Watch. Now yeah. <clears throat> yep. Oh, we gotta film her finally. So far, we're on track. Yes. And there's only one of me filming my videos, and then I'll get through an entire video without realizing that my audio is on. Those are the videos. Story of my life. We filmed a four-minute video like that. I think I just pressed buttons. I got you. Anytime that one of my videos is a voiceover, it's because I fucked up with the audio. Uh oh. We found the truth. What's your channel? We actually have a uh, 12% female viewers now. Really? It's your chance. We got you. What is it? Alexander24. Okay, hold out your hands and we'll we'll put a link to it. Oh, you gotta make a box. No, there it's right it here. Do it on okay. my phone. Click on my phone. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Look at this little dog. Tell me about it. Yep. Oh, there she is. You're famous. Go. A lady just said, I love your quads to Kyle. And then she blew me a kiss. <laughs> what the hell? 
That's uh, that's an interesting experience. That's Toronto for you. Comes the Starbucks. I got the mat. We're going uh, cliche today with the Starbucks. Classic white girl, baby. Can okay, one see. of the cups say Colossus and one of them say Fitness? Yeah, it's like everyone. She's, she's taking the time to color Colossus Fitness for us. Alright, we're going pink? Yeah, we're going pink. Sweet. <laughs> These are new cards, by the way, people. You haven't seen them. Who are you? Look at this. Hold on. Oh yeah, there we are. You have a gift. All right, so we just took over our boy JP, his Snapchat. Pretty solid, it's been a good time so far. Um, some people sent us some stuff. Usually when we answer Snapchats, a lot of you guys are jokers and you send us random things. Yeah. <laughs> if you send us something, send us something that's for us on our personal, I don't know about him, but let's see what we got. Oh, that's a legitimate question. Do I need to buy a gym membership to be more muscular or can I gain muscle at home? If so, equipment, what, what equipment would be best to buy? I started with P90X, all you really need is your body weight. I just need to be smart, intuitive, watch different videos. We made a more of an outdoor video with minimal equipment. We did have ropes and stuff, but more than anything, I just got a good set of dumbbells, probably 10s, 20s, 30s, three sets and you can do a ridiculous range of exercise with just those three things. Mm. See, point proven. All right. What kind of exercises can I do for football with dumbbells at home? I really can't afford a gym membership. Should I do full body workouts or do a split like push full legs? So at home for football, I'd really recommend doing your basics here. Chin-ups, if you can, get a chin-up bar, do your push-ups. Uh, really learn how to use your dumbbells. So just get a simple set. Push-pull legs is excellent, especially at home. Uh, there's great opportunities available. P90X is pretty solid. Uh, they do, they work a lot of plyometrics, explosiveness and stuff into that, so that's good at home. Um, even our videos or JP's, there's a lot of tips on good things. Um, we're gonna do more home stuff because we've actually gotten a lot of questions regarding that. So that's about as specific as I can be. I'd like to give you more detail, but uh, that's a long answer and I need to know variables. Oh, Kyle looking friggin' juicy. Oh my goodness. But he's over here just finishing up our video. The songs we use, we work out to, we try to listen to because it gets us in the mood to edit right, do our best job. I didn't really, okay. What are we doing, pal? Um, I just munching on some veggies, carb refeed, it's all good. But because so many of you are generous and you're helping us out on Patreon, uh, we got four supporters right now. You guys are the best. Uh, thank you, Paul. You're you're leading the pack, bro. You're the man. And so yeah, we're picking up this mic, 120 bucks. It's gonna make our voiceovers a lot better, and it's something we've shied away from doing because they haven't been top notch, and we just want everything to be perfect for you guys. And this is our summer to kill it. So yeah, we went with the Samsung Meteor mic. Apparently, it's really good. Guys, so this is actually the second week of our pendulum, our dynamic pendulum, if you guys are following our routine. We're not using the meter mic right here. Couldn't really figure it out, so I'm gonna have to go ahead and figure it out for the next video tomorrow. Read the instructions, something like that. Uh, Kai, you want to talk about your So this is uh, after eight sets of our speed reps, sets of two. Here is 365. I was very impressed with how it moved. Super happy, and uh, and yeah, I'm fired up. All right, so this is a 95% of my max, uh, the top of my second pendulum. Uh, my 90 moved really quick, so I moved into this. This is 515 pounds. Once again, really tired, 11th set here. So I came down, got really good depth, good control, could definitely have more speed, but it's the end of my pendulum. It is supposed to be fast, this one could have been better. The rep was really ugly. 
Not my fastest rep, but that's okay. These are optionals, that was 95%. That was my 11th rep. We did all this in about 20 minutes, 11 sets. So it's 11 sets of this much weight and volume in that time. Alrighty, so 385, for those of you who have been following along, um, you guys will know that I hit 375 as my top rep in our competition. So here I am going for a nice 385. This was 95% of my one rep max and it moved very fast. I was very happy and I'm really excited to hit a big number in competition. sound like a sprinkler. A lot slower than I would like, but... You sound like a sprinkler. Oh, do I? <laughs> it's our buddy Sonny. Really proud of him. This guy's lost over 100 pounds and he just, he's a savage. I told him I put it in. Look at this, some wrap. He's Pretty doing a bellless and uh, moved nice and fast. And no he excuses. was keeping up with us. It yeah. Was awesome. Alright, so this is a cool thing we picked up recently. First things first is double XL shirt. That's why it looks so small. Secondly, so it's called the Dead Wedge. Basically, what this does is it replaces the barbell jacks. We have them at Fortis, but when we're out and we can't use them, you pop her under here. She just rolls on all pretty. Well, you kind of got to make it work, but boom. And then you can put on your weight easier. Cool little plug. You can pick them up on Rogue for like 20 bucks. We're not sponsored by them, by the way. Yeah, we're just hyping it. Just think it's pretty cool. Don't have to be sponsored to talk about a product you like. That's convenient. All right, so yeah, basically you guys kind of have an update of where we were at at this point. As we were filming this, we are two weeks out and we're going to be filming an update video that will probably be up this week. Time is all confused on YouTube, but here's just some random stuff like deadlifts we just put in so we can talk to you guys. Uh, training's really good. Shredded strength has been a success. Numbers are up. Weight is crazy down. We're going to talk about it in that video. Uh, end it up, I guess. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Uh, it was a ton of fun making it. Josh killed the editing. We have the Toronto Fitness Pro Show video going up tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. Make sure to subscribe, comment, share this video with a friend, and tune in for the next video. Peace. So we ran into this guy. What's going on, guys? I want to give a special oh, shout out to Munchkin out there. We just got done training our goddamn calves, and they're blowing the fuck up. Call me Haymaker. Always going big, yeah you know the kid Call me Haymaker Dude, this is so annoying, I don't know why <laughs> Go with this, you're doing great Two person voiceovers are weird I don't like them at all <laughs> <laughs>